it's casual because that's it, the name of the program. Yes, it's the name of the program. What program? It's for uh, young. It's for my, my my website, my magazine, which is for younger people to to get them involved in politics hmm. because they're very disillusioned with politics at the moment. Yes. Yes. So hmm. that's why we called it casual politics. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to add anything more about casual politics, Lord Howe? <laughs> I don't understand your preoccupation. Oh, yes. <laughs> I'm interested to meet somebody like you who's fully informed <laughs> with the history of and the present significance <laughs> Thank politics. You. Thank you very much. Your appreciation, which isn't simply casual, <laughs> it's fundamentally quite serious. <laughs> no, we call it casual, so people they could get involved with it. That well, younger I'm, people. I'm glad. But that's what happened when the, when the Bow Group was founded. Oh yes. We we were people. This was in 1945 when the war was over, looking at significant features shaping the world that we went to live in. The Bow Group started addressing those issues in that way. And the young and intelligent people do it in most of the time. You are a similar person, young and intelligent, <laughs> who pay significant attention to politics, casually, carefully, <laughs> fundamentally. And do you think that younger people, they should get more involved in politics? Yes. In what ways? They should be interested to make sure it isn't rumbling in the hands of antiques so have some change from period to period and young people got an important influence to put into it not necessarily to dominate it but critical speculative interested concern in the way in which country is run is something that all sensible young people have got Continuous, careful, but on non interest. And how old were you when you first got involved in politics, Lord Howe? When I was at school. Because in my kind of school, which is no different from what they are these days, a school like Winchester has always been intellectually high, with intensely interested talk teaching one the whole time about Greek and Roman and then Elizabethan politics and history. They make you see what's interesting about politics and you remain in it for the rest of your life. And do we learn anything from getting involved in politics? What do we learn from it? We learn what's worth doing. And have you learnt enough in your uh, life in politics, Lord Howe? It interested my life, all the life. It hasn't dominated all the life. It's been good enough. And do you think that today the world has become a more dangerous world to live in? So uh, younger people, they should get more involved too? No, it's fluctuating all the time. Oh, yes, yes. So do you want to add anything more? Yeah. On that? Perfect.